The clock tower needs its clock winder. Every day, I get up and pump out the rising water. If I don't, the tree and all the precious plants it protects will be lost forever. But the clock winder is only a person, and people make mistakes. So I've made a decision. I will be the last clock winder. Levi, I picked up a distress signal from the clock tower. It's sinking. I thought you were through with that place. A long time ago. But if something's happened to Adia... <sighs> I'm too old for this, Jules. Please, Levi. I'm not letting my home go without a fight. Not this time. <sighs> Fine. But I get to stay in the ship. Loud and clear, Levi. Radio set and working. Good, good. How's the clock tower? Well, from out here, you wouldn't know it was sinking. Ah, yeah, well, it is. Scans show water's rising inside the trunk. We got here just in time. Yeah. I'd better find that pump. Hey, take it steady, Jules. Homecomings can be a rough ride.
Every plant in the clock tower needs protecting. Take this one. On Zanasha, it could grow 20 feet high. You're messing with me! I don't mess, Jules. It was their staple crop. Until they screwed up the ecosystem and killed it off. What? People get things wrong. A Zanashan farmer sent seeds here. These might be the only surviving samples. Here, try. Yeah, it's bitter. <laughs> they ate this? They loved it. There's no accounting for taste. Ugh, did I really sound like that? I miss this place. Is this one extinct too? No, it grows in all Sonara's major biomes. So it's not special? Every plant in the clock tower is special. It was a holy plant. An ancient religion brewed a ceremonial tea from its leaves. Can we try the tea? Uh, no, no, no. The archaeologist who sent it said under no circumstances was anybody to drink the tea. Why not? Let's just say I learned a long time ago that you never argue with an archaeologist. This one is a house plant. There was a Tokaran family that would gift a cutting whenever they welcomed in someone new. And they sent one here? Is it rare? No, they're practically everywhere. This one was just special to them. What happened? Clockwinder Rowan, my predecessor. Their notes didn't say. One of them sent the plant here after her wife died. She couldn't bear to keep it. But she couldn't abandon it either. That's so sad. But as long as it's alive, that family isn't forgotten. Isn't that wonderful? This place lifts that burden from others. We remember when they can't.
I even missed you, Faithful Storage Locker 229C. Delivery days are the best days. What have you brought me this time, Levi? Protein bars. Huh. Yeah, I can't complain. And oats. <laughs> so many oats. I just... Oh. And what's this? Oh, yes, Levi. You came through Vincent Raymond's instant noodles. <laughs> I'll be eating you for weeks. <laughs> the... What are you doing in my noodles? Um, is this Navoko? This isn't Navoko, is it? No. What's your name? Adia. I'm Jules. What is this place? The Clock Tower. What's that? It protects endangered plants, like a museum or a nursery. The label says this crate was going to Navoco. Levi's been known to mix up the odd noodle crate. Anyway, why were you in there in the first place? You're, what, five years old? I'm nine. Yeah, well, you're stuck here until Levi's next supply drop. What? How long is that gonna be? I've gotta get to Navoco. Navoco. Yeah, you mentioned that a time or two, but listen, you're not going anywhere for the next six months. Shoot. <laughs> not the word I would have chosen.
Levi, still dry, if you don't count the blusher juice stains. Any sign of Adia? Only old recordings. Still, I found her gloves, and they still work. Thank goodness. This would be impossible without the gardeners. Gardeners? Oh, those things. Yeah, they're, they're pretty neat. I always call them loopies myself. Which is why you're not allowed to name things. They're the gardeners. <laughs> Did you come up with that or something? Adia did. They look after this place, so show them some respect. Do you think that's what caused all this? Her big automation project? She was obsessed with making herself obsolete. The gardeners, the frog... Everything that happened... Well, I guess we'll find out. I just hope we're not too late. Don't borrow trouble. Get on and find that pump. Connecting pipe is fitted, and uh, seal is good. Wow! What is it? Part of my new automation system. The clockwinder has to pump out the water every day, but with this machine and the gardeners, that's a thing of the past. Why does it look like a frog? It's not a frog. It's a hydrokinetic manifold that lets my gardeners automate the pump with the power of bomb berries. Okay. It's a cool frog, though. Oh, you should make a whale next time. That was so right. It is a cool frog. Thank you. 
What's this one? <gasps> Did that fruit just explode? <laughs> The clock tower uses fruit for energy. These ones are just especially energetic. They're more finicky than blushers, but sometimes you need that extra oomph. Why would the tree need oomph? Oh, you don't know half of what this place can do. How did they grow their fruits before the tree? There's nothing out there but water. Wait, how did they grow the tree? And what makes you think they grew the tree here? without her. <laughs> 